Ladies, before you fuck that dude, make sure he gets you something nice to eat. You know what I mean? Make sure your belly is full. Make sure it's a, a nice restaurant where the ambiance is beautiful and amazing. Before you fuck that dude, make sure he's a gentleman. Make sure he deserves into the buns. Because just don't be out here fucking for fun. It's your boy, boy, it's a four wings and fries. Hit them likes. Hit them fucking subscribes. Hit them, uh, damn. Why was I so aggressive? I'm sorry. My bad, y'all. Uh, yeah. Hit them subscribes. Hit them notifications so you'll be notified for these vibes and all that. Oh, uh, yeah. But shorty, I got a question. Are you a whole ass bitch if you suck dick on a first date and you fuck on a first date? Is you a whole ass bitch? Nah, well, let's get into it right now. Look, because it's, it's different situations. I feel like, look, we are grown here, right? We grown. And we, we're grown enough to make our decisions well aware of what we're doing. And well aware of what we're capable of. So like there's no there's no shame in doing what you got to do. If you just meet somebody, y'all have a good time. Things are going great. You on a date. It's late. Enjoy your meal. Enjoy your movie. Walk in the park. You did some painting. You did some, uh, some, uh, some, uh, what's that shit from the movie Ghosts? Where they uh doing sculptures and shit, uh vases, vases, however you want to pronounce it. Uh pottery, they doing that type of shit. Whatever the fuck you was doing on your date. Everything was going good. Marvelous. Immaculate. And then if you decide you wanna give boys some pussy, ain't nothing wrong with that. That don't make you no hoe. Now if y'all went home, had a nice little evening. You had a little drink to cap off the night. Some things start touching and y'all start rubbing and all them type of shits. Then you had consensual safe sex. Breakfast in the morning and he left or whatever. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Now, I'm going to tell you the side of the story. If, if When you could be a hoe for fucking on the first date. Now, this lady that just fucked this gentleman on the first date because she was really feeling him and they liked each other. And then the, t and the, I even, and then the, the sexual energy intensified and it was in the air and they feel like they wanted to take it there. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But it's nothing no wrong with that. Only if she don't be doing that shit all the time. For you bitches who be out here sucking and fucking every weekend. You just meet motherfuckers. You go out to the club with the purpose and the intentions. And you be like, I'm looking for somebody to fuck tonight. Somebody need to cast their sperm inside this box. Some of you bitches be doing that shit and you go out purposely to find somebody you fuck. You can halfway like the motherfucker. You gonna give him some pussy anyway because your box is community box. And you're, you're just giving it away. Like, you're giving it away. Give it, give it, give it, give it away. Why you keep giving the box away? And that's when you a whole ass bitch. Like, you meet the nigga. Like, y'all don't even go nowhere. He pull up to your spot or you pull up to his spot or whatever. If he even got a spot, y'all meet up at your crib. All he brought was a little half a pint of Hennessy, and he brought some Reggie. You feel me? And then you 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 smoked the Reggie with him. He brought you two chicken wings. He ain't even get you the four box or the six box with the fries. He got you the two wings. You smoked Reggie, half a pint of Hennessy. He thugged you out. He Fucked you from the back, the little boosie, little baby, uh, Chief Keef. And then that's it. He left. And you do that repeatedly. Damn near four times a week. Yeah, you a whole ass bitch. You just met this nigga. You just met him. Now you in the back of his Honda Coupe, topping him off. Something real sloppy. You topping him off real sloppy. Spit dripping all down his balls. You topping the shit all off. He don't even deserve all that. But your whole ass, you back there topping him the fuck off. And then you going to bounce the bun, slide up and down on his meat. In the back seat of the coupe. 
Because that's what you do. That's That makes you a whole ass bitch. You're doing this shit every fucking day. You looking for a different nigga to fuck. Everybody know your name in different squirt, in different circles, in different squads. They know who you are. They know who you are. Mrs. Jump Off, that's who you are. So it, it, you, you, could, you could be a hoe on the first date when you fuck it. Or you, you like, but if you, if you like the bitch that I just described, most times it ain't no date. She just met the motherfucker. He hollered at her. He got a number. Yo, what's up? Yo, what you doing? So blah, blah, blah. You trying to link up. They link up and they fuck. That's all that. That's the first time she met that dude. Went no food, ate. No movies was watched. None of that shit. Just buns was got. Now, if it just casually happened, blah, blah, blah. Like I said, you, you genuinely like to do. And that so happens to happen. You know what I mean? And then she continue on and they continue on dating. And then eventually they make something happen. You feel me? Make a relationship out of this thing. Because they genuinely fucks with each other. And genuinely likes with each other. They just so happen to have sex on the first day. No, you is not a hoe. You just a grown ass woman who know what you want. And then like it just happened. And you just felt he was genuinely a good dude. But you hoe ass bitches. You just out here sucking and fucking. The first day you meet a motherfucker. And he gonna say the first date. The first date. Day with no date in place. You let that motherfucker put his dick in your face. It's your boy Ballhead Tay. Four ways and fries. Hit them likes. Hit them subscribes. Hit them notifications and that notification bell so you'll be notified for these vibes. Comment down below. Let me know what you think of this video and do you think she a hoe? No condoms media.